Jackie Matubia in the famous China Square. Hello guys, it's your girl Fashion Status. Call me the queen of one and gossip and I'm back again with another banger. <laughs> yes guys, today it's all about Jackie Matubia uh, going to the famous uh, China Square and what she shopped. And guys, before that, remember this video is brought to you by of Tetratic Electronics and Aven Honey. Yeah, if you wanna buy electronics, you wanna fix, you wanna repair colors on this number, we are your plug at Tetratic Electronics. You can also follow us on our social handles where we post most of the details Instagram at Tetratic Electronics and Facebook. Like our Facebook page, <laughs> uh, Tetra Tech Electronics. Also sell honey, so if you wanna buy honey colors on this number, we are your plug at Aven Honey. And like our Facebook page as well at Aven Honey. So back to today's gossip. <laughs> yes, as I've told you guys, uh, uh, today it's all about Jackie Matubia uh, going into this famous place that, uh, that has been trending of late. I actually didn't know of the place, but then, um, I saw so many videos uh, on TikTok. At first, I saw a friend post um, on WhatsApp, my friend, and then she had written that it's a one stop over, you know, as a one stop over place where you can buy everything. And so I got curious to know uh, which place is this, the China, <laughs> the China place where is it located and then when i went to tiktok actually after that immediately i saw many videos on fyp uh about the china place and all that so i decided let me let me research about the place and um I found people saying that it's a it's a place where things are cheap and all that and then uh yesterday uh yeah and then yesterday Jackie Matubia decided, you know what, you have to go and uh, to this place, China Square, and see what you can shop. So uh, she mentioned that her daughter with Zari, she has been pressuring her to go to China Place and get toys for her and also a small, uh, small baby. So as you can see in these videos, they were with Zari. That is a firstborn daughter as well. Now she has a firstborn uh, daughter uh, that she got from the first marriage. Yeah, so they went together. Uh, as you can see, they go to their place, and then um, she said that the prices of uh, the things right there they are cheap. And so she was mentioning that she has been actually been she has been taken there by Zari only to buy toys. Imagine <laughs> all the way to go and buy toys. But then she said that the place is a bit cheap, and uh, people are also saying it's cheap. But then others are saying it's just being it's it's just overrated. Their prices are not even that cheap when you compare to kamkunji and all that you find kamkunji is even way cheaper but then others are saying it's cheap and all that but uh, it's a place that has really raised a lot of questions especially even for influencers as you all know if an influencer wants wants to advertise a place you have to pay them yeah Yes, you have to pay them. But then many influencers have come out advertising uh, this China place. We have seen even um, Shonarwa, she has advertised the place. Another influencer is uh, the one I posted, I'm posting right here, Jackie Matubia. You know, most influencers for you, to, for them to measure you even in their, in their Instagram stories, you have to pay them. But then we have seen them, uh, the influencers, they are doing it for free. And uh, as you all know, it's... um a shop or a, rather a mall that is owned by a chinese so people are wondering are they advertising because it's a foreigner who is owning the place if a kenyan is one was owning the place could they be advertising it this much so people are saying that it's kind of double standards for the influencers because they're really advertising this place actually they're the ones who have made people to know but it, if, if it was a Kenyan business, it could be hard for them to post. Maybe they could have said they'd be paid for them to post, you know. So guys, just comment down there. What do you think about influencers uh, adver uh, advertising this China place? And yet when a Kenyan uh, approaches them, they want them to be paid for them to advertise a Kenyan business. Leave a comment down there about what you think, uh, what you think about the whole issue, okay? Yeah, so that's how Jackie Matubia went to China Square. That's uh, Those are some of the influencers that 
that I've gone to China Square, they'll keep on updating you, okay? So guys, remember to like our Facebook page at Digital Tech Electronics and Aven Honey. We are your plugs when it comes to electronics and then you just call us or call away. We offer the best services at the best and affordable prices. And um, you remember to give the video a thumbs up. Please don't watch without liking, okay? Like the video, share, comment, subscribe, and put on the notification bell so that you're notified in time I post a video. You know, I got you when it comes to trending news, gossips, and the most recent stories. So if you don't want to miss, subscribe and put on the notification bell, okay? So thank you so much for watching, guys. See you on my next gossip. Bye.